two hands cocked behind the head. Everybody talking about, oh, he gonna have an X on his back and they gonna come harder. How you think he gonna get better if they don't come harder? I want you mad as hell at my son when you see him, you like, I'm gonna tear his ass up. Cause you know what he thinking? This is what I'm here for. You are not gonna give me nothing, but I'm gonna make you a believer. No, I just wanna see, cause it's training for you. Cause you're gonna go to college. Right, right. You guys are gonna go to the pros. You guys are gonna make lives and careers out of this. And you gotta learn to tune out the haters. Well, you have to deal with that, right? right? Is that yeah. right, coach? Yeah. You have to know you've made it when you have haters. Absolutely, yeah. I told them all this. Somebody got to be the best player in the world. Why not you? To take it away. Lonzo Ball, one-handed pass up ahead. LaMelo with the lay -in. Oh, it's beautiful to watch. Oh, it's not a beautiful release, but it is beautiful to hear it splash through the net. LaMelo Ball, the freshman for three. LaMelo. Oh, my goodness. The second time they've done it tonight. Well, to use the touch the football team. Where do you want to see yourself grow as a player between now and when you reach campus in 2019? Uh, just to get stronger, because at the next levels it gets more aggressive and stronger. Has there ever been a more nationally famous sophomore in high school than Lamella? Account right now that calls LaMelo Ball uh, the most hated high school athlete of all time. He was a basket hanger and a ball hog. Cherry he picker. Was in high school. If this rubbed you the wrong way, that he didn't play the game the right way, he'll learn. Yeah. He's got time. Eventually he will. Or he won't. But it's okay. He scored 92. Let's have fun with it. Game for the ages last night from Chino Hill sophomore LaMelo Ball, who scored 92 points against Los Osos. Well, the 15-year-old is the youngest brother of UCLA freshman Lonzo Ball, but may have outdone anything his bigger brother ever yeah. did in it's high school. Like, cool, how you got to 92. I wasn't expecting to get that high. How many do you think you could have scored last night? If I knew, if I was going for that high, uh, I believe in the hundreds. This is a kid who on his 16th birthday was given by his parents a Lamborghini. You still got to focus, all right? Because it's easy to lose focus. LaMelo Ball's a teenager with millions of Instagram followers, a scholarship waiting for him to UCLA, and now a signature shoe from the Big Ballers brand, the first ever for a high schooler. Two seconds. You ain't got to play. Here, hold the ball because you ain't used to it. And until you learn to be like your brother and play both hands, you'll be sorry as hell. Hey, is it great basketball being played? No. Is it, is it the best thing for these kids? Probably not. But one thing you cannot argue with 
is the interest of the people. Possibly the last opportunity that LaMelo Ball and company for the big ball is going to have at this one. They inbound it, a little give-and-go action. LaMelo, skip pass, it's stolen by Zion. He wants the dagger. Zion to the rim, he threw it down and put him on the line. Zion put that one in the cooler. According to the LA Times and Ramona Shelburne, is pulling LaMelo Ball from Chino Hills High School. But I think basketball's gonna work out for LaVar more than it's gonna work out for LaMelo. We got the tutors coming in here to tutor you to get these classes done. You, you gotta stay focused on that. I don't think they're NBA players. I think Lonzo Ball is the best of the kids. With you, man, how we how we looking with the teams and what we got going on? Oh, we looking good right now. So let me give you the breakdown. Right now is between Lithuania and Croatia. Yes. Going to Lithuania to play professional basketball is the right town. move. He said no one ever for like in the history of the nation. What do you make of all the hoopla around the ball's arrival? I don't like it. Ladies and gentlemen, we don't even know if they can play Division One basketball. You're going to Lithuania to play basketball? Kids cannot play against grown men. Was this worth it? Did this crash and burn? For LaMelo, uh, it, it wasn't very good. Been thinking about what you were saying and uh, what's best for us as far as for you and the brand. You got to be the face of the JBA. The one person in this I'm worried about is LaMelo. This is, to me, the beginning of a sad tale. LaMelo, it's too much sizzle, too much flash, and not enough just making people better. We want an expression. We gotta get ready to go. I'm ready. Uh, bro, bro, bro. You're supposed to be the leader, bro. You're supposed to be first, bro. We gotta get ready. Let's go. I ain't, I ain't captain from this team. I'm just another player, bro. I'm just another player, bro. If y'all lose about 30 and then the next day you come to practice laughing, like, that make me mad. It should make you mad. You captain of the team. Y'all building bad habits. And it start with you. You over here running bull lines. Y'all play for LA, you got that thing on your chest. Y'all need to get better. A couple nights ago, they need to come and bounce back with a win tonight. Now let's do our thing. Let's have fun out there. Let's go get this W. Win all three. One, two, three. It goes out of bounds, but. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're a selfish mother. We cannot. Respond like that. You of all people, but you let me down. You, 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 my brand, you, my game. We don't win because your ass. Let's go. What you want to do? Son, I told your ass. I said, you getting on my bad last nerve because you're doing the wrong over and over and over. Something's going on, son. Let me know what's up, man. I don't really know how you're going to take this right now, but uh, I just want to finish off, like, my high school, like, senior year. LaMelo, he can go back to high school, but he can't play sports. Yeah. Oh, you're making a fool. LaMelo, 
he can go back to high school, but he can't play sport. Yeah. Jermaine Jackson, head coach at Spire Academy. Yeah. Okay. Number one pick, 2020. LaMelo. I think he's the best player in the world on our high school level, and we want to showcase that. Just understand, we got the guy to make the blind see and the cripple walk in LaMelo Ball. A young dog bringing it, young dog on it. Young dog won it, young dog serious. Run that team, he's putting everybody in position. You got to be the coach on the floor. You got that. I do. If Melo were to go back to high school, there's absolutely no way that high schools would be able to compete with him. If he were to actually be the number one pick in the NBA, that'd be a stunner, wouldn't it? And then he and his brother would have gone one and two in the NBA. That's pretty good. I would stand back, I would clap, I would say hooray. Bobble for a second over there by McCaskill. Here's Lamelo Ball. This is down the middle, slamming it home. I guess it's a Lamelo Ball. Some of this, this ball taken away by Lamelo Ball. Quick toss. So what you gonna do after school? Um, I don't know. Dad think I'm not gonna be able to play in college, so he think I should just go to the G League. Right. In the G League, there's some hungry dogs in that G League that's trying to get out of there. And they will embarrass them, and they will challenge them. The best high school team in the country is fire. Everybody know that. And I guarantee you, when that buzzer go off, we'll be smiling as champions. Who agree with that blessing? Let's rock this. Let's go. Champs on three. Don't hang your hands too long now, because it's done, man. Y'all that one up. The good thing about this is, when you get to a championship, and in life, whatever you got to do to, to get over the, over the hump, to get a job, whatever, you're going to do it now. Because this is a raggedy-ass feeling, man. But life goes on. And I'm going to say one thing. Thank you guys, all y'all, with all you guys laughing and joking. I saw my son having fun, man. I appreciate every one of y'all. Playing with my boy, just let him have a good time. Especially you, Jermaine. You came on here because you said you had an announcement to make right. about where you want to play next year. What are you doing? Uh, next year, take my talents to the NBL. Okay. Go for the Illawarra Hawks. Excellent. Over in Australia. Yep. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, so, like, yeah, for sure. there's a lot of pressure on you guys. This ain't a cupcake league. You're not <laughs> going to get, this ain't high school. This ain't college. Yeah. This is pros. There ain't a night off in this league. Are you ready for that? Right. You're playing against guys that got to pay rent. <laughs> they are not, they're not going to let you. You see them highlights? Cut them out. No, no, he went through a teenage experience that I would not want. He seems to have grown up and matured in some ways. If this works out for him, great for him. That's the name everybody sort of gravitates to. LaMelo Ball has been a celebrity in our culture for a really long time. I think there's a fear of him getting exposed against real talent. So send him overseas where we won't be paying attention. It won't be on local American TV. And the competition will probably be weaker. He's done a really good job of tying up in defense. Lamelo shuts one. Keith Ball with the steal. It's a giant. Have a look at this for modern day basketball. We've got one player over six foot six. It's Ball done Special for two. To keep Lavar away from the youngest son, because the youngest son is the one. NBA executives are now rearranging their schedules to get to Australia as fast as they can to see him because they're afraid he might shut it down. Oh, how about that? That's what he actually from Ball. NBA scouts are projecting him as potentially the number one overall pick. From everything I've seen, this is the most talented prospect in the draft. There are no other 18-year-olds on the planet who can handle the ball and facilitate like LaMelo Ball can. Who's number one? I would say right now it's trending towards potentially LaMelo Ball. LaMelo, here's a taste and step, wraps it up. Oh, oh my what? goodness! Ten seconds to work with. In a three. They need a three ball. LaMelo! Oh! 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 Three, head around the world. You move out the way. <laughs> this man is doing it in one of the...
the world outside the NBA.